Hong Kong's government wants Beijing to allow one person, one vote for governor in the 2017 elections, but it agrees with Beijing that all candidates must be vetted by a special committee before they're allowed to run. This opposition legislator tried to throw a birdcage at the government. Probably he meant the government was trying to keep Hong Kong within China's cage. People watching from the legislators' galleries showed their displeasure with the government's plans, but outside, pro-Beijing groups said it represented mainstream opinion. Meanwhile, in Thailand, authorities destroyed thousands of guns confiscated in criminal cases between 2000 and 2013. Authorities say that the 34,000 weapons were destroyed to prevent them from entering the black market. All guns were burnt to recycle the metal. Student survivors of the Sewer ferry sinking marched on Parliament demanding a special investigation into the disaster. They have collected more than 3.5 million signatures calling for an inquiry. It's unclear whether the legislature will act. The disaster has caused severe damage to the popularity of the South Korean government. In an attempt to recover, South Korean President Park Geun-hye replaced seven of the, her 17 cabinet ministers. Hi, I'm Tui Vu, the host of Link Asia. Catch Link Asia every Friday on Link TV, 9.30 p.m. Eastern, 6.30 p.m. Pacific. Check our website for local listings on KCET Los Angeles and PBS's The World Channel.